It was late one winter night, long past my bedtime, when Pa and I went owling. There was no wind. The trees stood still as giant statues, and the moon was so bright the sky seemed to shine. Somewhere behind us, a train whistled blue, long and low, like a sad, sad song. I could hear it through the woolen cap Pa had pulled down over my ears. A farm dog answered the train, and then a second dog joined in. They sang out trains and dogs for a real long time, and when their voices faded away, it was as quiet as a dream. We walked on toward the woods, Pa and I. Our feet crunched over the crisp snow, and little gray footprints followed us. Pa made a long shadow, but mine was short and round. I had to run after him every now and then to keep up, and my short round shadow bumped after me. But I never called out. If you go owling, you have to be quiet. That's what Pa always says. Owl Moon is a 1987 children's picture book by Jane Yolen and illustrated by John Schoner. It won many awards, most notably being the Caldecott Medal for its illustrations and has appeared on Reading Rainbow in the U.S. Yolen describes the book as a positive family story. It's about a girl and her father. Usually stories of a little girl are with her mother. It is gentle yet adventurous, quiet yet full of sound. The story deals with a father that takes his daughter owling for the first time on a cold winter's night. Along their way, they encounter a great horned owl. According to Jane Yolen's website, she is actually Yolen's child, Heidi Stemple. The Pa character is based on her husband, an avid outdoorsman and bird watcher. For more of Owl Moon, please click on the link below. Thanks for watching. Great news! We now have a podcast. Please visit us at littlecozynook.com for our weekly read-along children's books for your little snuggle bugs. See you soon!